everybody, it's King Damon, and welcome back to, uh, well, me. <laughs> I know it's been a while, guys, but I've been, sorry to say, been busy. Um, lots of stuff has been going on, a lot of work, uh, everything like that. So let's get right into it. So the reason why I want to do this game is because it's got a new update. I wasn't sure if I want to start off where I began because, you know what, it had such a huge update. Like, it's ridiculous. So let's start off by, like, as you can see, normal stuff. But we're gonna get into it. For starters, it's a floating head of hair. <laughs> and then now I kinda like this how it opens up with like it doesn't show the Professor Oak, because that doesn't never make sense to me, because it's like he didn't meet the Professor Oak right away like everyone else did. To be fair, no one else does, but Professor Oak, this guy wasn't with him, you know what I mean? So I kinda like how they did this sort of opening. Uh, I am a Pokemon. So let me, uh, you guys can read this, or you can listen to me, or do both somehow. I love how you forgot his name. You don't have amnesia. That's not how it works. Um, so we're gonna obviously call myself King. There we go. Uh, so there was an update for the Pokemon Ash one, but I'm gonna just start off where we are, because I saw there was a big difference. Uh, I met him in Pal- in the, the Paladown Forest. That's a little weird. Technically, you haven't met him yet, I guess. Um, so anyway, uh, so what's been going on recently? <laughs> I know you guys will love that who I'm calling. I decided to call him something different. <laughs> uh, it was Phoenix? That's right, I remember his name is Phoenix. That is a reference to my greatest rival. Uh, <laughs> So this is basically him, I guess, telling a story. Is this like a hobbit or something? Like he's telling, like, this is my in a in a forest in a land of Pokemon. There lived a weird boy. Let's take this. Yeah, see, this made more sense when they put you. Um, so you guys can take a look at this. I'm just gonna be talking a bit about what's been going on and catch you up with my life. So really, what's been going on? Just a lot of work and a lot of crazy people I deal with. As you guys know, I work in like a pharmacy sort of environment, so. Uh, as far as we'll have a nickname, I like how they're gonna have a nickname. I don't want a nickname. Come on. Uh, so, like, I deal with a lot of crazy people, and it's just lately it's been getting on me a little bit, but I mean, in there. Uh, that's why I love doing this sort of stuff, because you know what? It doesn't drive me as ma mad as. <laughs> well, that's a bit hard. That's what that's why, to be fair. Um. I go a little insane. I do talk to myself and stuff. <laughs> At least my other job, I'm not talking to myself most the time. Uh, but aside from that, I mean, I had a bird basically, I think he wanted to have sex with me. Uh, me and my wife spent some time in our hotel. Woo! Yeah. <laughs> Getting away from everything. And, uh,. Yeah, there was this little moment that you guys should take, take a look at the picture on my Twitter. My language went a little weird there. Um, Alright, go Pokeball. Yeah, here's the Pokeball. Oh, see, that's better. I like how she healed my Pokemon. Um, okay, so now I guess I just kind of go to the forest like before. Anyway, so I run into this we, this guy who basically lets he had his hair look on your shoulder, like on your shoulder, kind of photogenic way. You know, you pay him a little bit. Pay, I, I think he's pretty fair. I gave him a little bit of a $10 tip on it because I think he paid fair. Um, yeah, so the one bar parrot, if you guys take a look at the picture, I, I don't know if you want me to show it in this video or you guys can just take a look at my Twitter, maybe get my Twitter some likes. Uh, you know, some views too. Um, this one was like rubbing into my ear, the one on my, you'll see on my right side. And then on my left side, this bird was like whispering the weirdest things to me. He's like, what you gonna do? I'm just like, I don't know, I've been bullied by a parrot. I was just, I was so creeped out. What the hell, there's a Pokemon over here? Oh, awesome, one potion. Love it. Um, on one side, you... Really? <laughs> and then, you know, crazy. Okay, okay, that's fair. Um, what the hell? Huh. That's time I could just kind of hop into this area and then it just kind of bring. Okay, so they made you work for it a little bit. Um, 
Yeah, he's whispering some really random stuff into my ear, and I, I am totally baffled by it. Wait, what the hell? I have to go this way? Oh, that's weird. They changed the path. Oh, that's creepy. Make It's a little nicer. Oh, here we go. Oh. Ah, I see. They're, they kind of did it a little bit nicer. You almost had it. Yeah. Okay, sorry, I'm getting intrigued into the thing because they're kind of, they change up the sentencing a little bit. And I know it's also probably World's Pokeball is a little different. Anyway, so yeah, that was basically it. Um, it, also, if you guys are ever in Ottawa, go to this place called, uh, what was the restaurant we went to? It started with an M. It's like right next to the Chateau Laurier. That's the one we went to. Um, it's like right next to it, literally. Go to that place, make the best farmhouse burger. Oh, what the hell? I just got... Uh, that was a little messed up. Um, so yeah, I think I'm going to probably show all this because it seems like they changed quite a bit. Not much. Oh, come on, Tower. You're not going to lecture me. You're not superior to me. I am the master of craziness and... See, this makes sense. I want to go see. Oh, who's this? <laughs> oh, I just love that. And what the hell? Okay, so they gave her a Pokemon. That's why. Let me see here. Hey, get over here. That's rude. Don't walk away from me. Huh. <laughs> so they're saying like people were starting to complain about they had to walk so far in Pokemon Center. That's nice. So that, that's trying to explain why she's here now. Awesome. All right, so let's see. Did they change up the place a little bit? Not really, I guess. I think there really wasn't a reason to fix the area. Just some of the line said, you know, make the city a little bit better, stuff like that. Let's take a look at the what the what? Why is there a Jigglypuff now? Oh, good. This one knows how to draw. Oh God, it's evil Jigglypuff. All right, well, I I don't want to touch the other ones. No, actually, you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna touch the other one. See what's going on. Ah! Oh, awesome! They talk about Ash! Oh shit! No, no, I gotta read that again. That was hilarious. These birds are aggressive. I heard they attacked the boy from Palace Town and his Pikachu. Oh, that is freaking awesome. They say you can take this Mario Scum and wear it. What if the Mario had more than one baby? Ooh! Love this guy. That is so true. What if it has twins? Like, does one of them kill the dad or something? Like, I'm sure these Pokemon don't just, you know, there is some... Come on. Oh, this is a Bulbasaur. What are you doing? You're the thief, aren't you? Dun, 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 dun. Ooh. Really? So they push him over the side? That's awesome. I'm sorry, I'll find them right now. Uh... You better find my Pokemon. Okay, so this time he doesn't get all... You better find those Pokemon, I'm gonna call the cops. And again, to be fair, he startled them. So now there's four Pokemon to find. So, wait. Okay, uh, assuming from last time, one was over... What the heck? Why is there a Pidgey just randomly... Okay, here's Jigglypuff. I better knock it out before it sinks. Yeah! Okay, that's it. Interesting. I wonder why they decided to add a fourth Pokemon. Was there a fourth in the book? I've never read the book, so... I mean, I read a couple, but... Not enough to say I'm flu I can remember or fluent in it, so... Um... Is this, is this one of the Pokemon in it? Oh god, don't... You know what? You know what? If we're gonna have Battle of Wits, I'm gonna do it to you first. That's right. I'm not letting you knock me out. Uh-uh. Oh, hell no. I'm gonna show Coward I'm better than him in every single way. <laughs> oh yeah, speaking of which, um, you guys probably know that Tower hasn't been doing I thought he had like a lineup of videos for a while, but I don't know if something happened to his computer, maybe it didn't upload. What? Oh, screw you. Don't need a damn berry. Anyway, um, so he's been gone for a while, apparently on military training. So uh, for, I don't know if I, we share fans, but... Like, you guys, I'm sorry I haven't been able to, he hasn't been able to, but, you know, like, we're not strong in the, 
this thing to make enough, like, uh, to make enough to be able to say, hey, uh, oh, what the hell? Screw you! Oh, what the hell? That was Bulbasaur. So, I guess one of them got away. I'm a little confused about that. Um, okay, what does she have to do? Okay, anyway, <laughs> another weird reference to Ash. Um, so is the Cubone in this area? <laughs> ah, that's awesome. I love that. Uh, okay, can you guys tell me if you saw a Cubone this way? I don't want to go in this. Oh, okay, well, then screw you guys. Uh, how about you? Alright. That's a little depressing. Alright, so I'm going to assume. Uh, what the hell? Oh, no way! Now I can find Pokemon here. Awesome. I love how I can catch Pokemon. It's like, it never made sense to me that the forest here, you couldn't see any Pokemon. So it was like literally just, it has one purpose, which is Mew. That that's it, then you're just done. Oh, what the? Okay, so she still says the basic same thing as she did last time. All right, so I don't know if that was different. I can't remember. It's been a little while since I played this, so I can't re What the heck? Wasn't known until Carpenter removed several trees. Huh. Okay. That's a weird little fact, but uh, thank you. <laughs> I feel enlightened. Uh, let's see if it... What the heck? Really? You want to find a Caterpie? Okay, he must be a future, uh, bug hunter. Um, okay, so the Cubone's not in here anymore? I found the Jigglypuff right away. Which is surprising, because that's, uh, you know, first time I ever saw that. Um, oh, here's a bug catcher looking guy. Hey, have you seen a Cubone? Oh, thank you. Yeah, that's uh, self-esteem. Okay, so the Cubone's now in the water. So that makes sense. That makes sense. He wanted to drink. Now he's gonna go towards the water. I found I can always ca just carry, but I want to knock it out first. Oh, that's mean. That's a jerk. I love Cubone. Uh, water gun. Cause you know it works. Oh God, man, that that, that definitely did well. Uh, Cubone, I love you, but, uh, can I capture it, please? Do I have a Pokeball? I want to capture a Cubone. Oh, I want Cubone. I love him. I, I, I don't know what it is about Cubone. Maybe because he's so emo and I love it. But I love that Cubone. Or maybe it's because I have mommy issues and I like to murder her, too. <laughs> uh, no. Wow, I'm leveling up pretty good. Jeez. Alright, knocked out the Cubone. Yes, got it. Now I need to find the rest. Someone beat me to it. Well, I did see a Squirtle in the lab. Woohoo! Ho ho ho. Or is that ho ho ho? That's ho ho ho. Ho ho! Ho ho! Anyway. Oh, what the hell? So, now they make it so that it's just following me? Is it like leading me to the others, or is it just following me a lot? That makes more sense that it's suddenly just going to a gym. Actually, to be fair, that doesn't make sense why I would just go to the gym anyway. That makes no sense to me. I don't know if that's what it was in the book, like you found in the gym, but uh, yeah. All right, so let's see where, where, or where can a Spiro be? Oh, what the hell? Ah, oh, okay. So the Spiro is somewhere in here. All right, let's find him. See where? Oh, where? Hey, there he is. Hi. I found. Uh oh. It looks like it's about to strike. Well, it attacked Ash. I mean, it's gonna attack you. <laughs> All right. Let's do this. Attack! Attack the Spiro! Spiro! That was a terrible impression of Spiro I ever heard. Let's see if I can think of any other crazy shenanigans that have been going on since. Um, because it's been a little while. Oh, uh, we celebrate my wife's mother's birthday recently. Um, okay, so I want... Okay, wait, wait, wait. Before I finish this, like, I gotta find... 
the, bo the bubbles are gonna appear. What the hell? Did I do like out of order or something? Like, was I supposed to find that first? Because, uh, you know, considering I played the ga last game. Anyway. Ah, uh, okay, so he is back at the gym. Okay, so. God damn it. No, I don't want to battle Pidgey. I want to capture him later, but I don't want him right now. No, go away, Pidgey. Go away. Thank you. Anyway, so we celebrated her mom's birthday recently. Went off really well. We had kind of like a disco theme. Go figure on that one, I know. She never really had a themed birthday before, so I mean, it was really nice that we were able to uh, give her one. Actually, she's never really celebrated a birthday. Her and her two brothers kind of used to... Oh, wait. Sorry, getting off topic here. What is this? Ooh, rare candy. Ooh, piece of candy. Ooh, piece of candy. Anyway. <laughs> um... So she never really had a birthday before. Uh, God damn it, Pidgey. Give me a Pidgey. Yeah, it's a Pidgey. Um, so she never really had a birthday before. Aside from bro, like not really specified to her. So it was really nice we were able to do it. She, we gave her two pinatas. One that kind of looked like uh, what the hell? Trying to run away. How did you get here so fast? Two of the Pokemon Spearow and Cubone. Here you go. Hey, see, this makes more sense. Before it made no sense. Like, ah, uh, I just, you know, beat them. See, that makes sense. I'm sorry, I'm reading here. So I saw Jigglypuff heading to Viridian City, so I came here to search for it. That makes sense. Okay, yeah, I'm sorry. It didn't make no sense that some random kid gave me run shoes. It made more sense that he. Wow, okay. Wow, he's so bitchy. Oh, there he is. There's Jigglypuff. No, come back here. Ah, uh, Jigglypuff. Where the hell did it go? I'm a pathetic old man. I won't let you pass. You trying to pass? Taste my fury. Old man Tiara, magic. Oh, what the hell? The old man chuck a rock at me? I'm gonna murder that old man. I swear to God. Okay, let's see if. Uh, did Jigglypuff go this way? Let's see. Nope, uh, but I found something else. Okay. Another potion. Uh, what else should I talk about? What else happened recently? And, oh, my wife went for an allergy test uh, just the other day. Yeah. Um, so she's apparently allergic to everything. And the guy thought the best... Um, okay, this is the part that pissed me off. But she's... What the hell? Wish you guys could see my facial expression when I said, I'm trying to catch a fish. Oh, it's trying to catch a fish. All right, well, I'm just gonna... Well, I know that, but you're getting... Okay, I can't swim like Ash, apparently. Um, so his suggest he was very... I'm gonna say this, I'm sorry to anyone who's ever had an allergy doctor, but I hate it when they say, oh, that's a nice design of the gym. Hey, there's Bulbasaur. Ooh, bitch slap. Don't be scared. Okay, see, this makes more sense that he just, instead of creepily comes up behind me and says, oh, Little boy, little boy. This makes more sense that Bulbasaur's saying, like, uh, no, I won't be with him. Yeah, see, this is better. Yeah, you know what? This I like this bear. The, bravo. Um, servant Machoke sent out Machoke. Okay, they might have done this part a little bit differently. Um, anyway, so what the guy suggested was to put down our dog, and he said this one first, or to give it away. And I'm just thinking, uh, no, that's offensive to me, dude. I'm, I was just thinking like. I wasn't there when she said because I had to go put some money in the car, but like, when she told me, I'm just thinking like, I'm a pagan, I'm a Celtic animist, and that's offensive to say just to put down a dog again. I'm sorry to those, like, no, actually, no, I'm not going to say I'm sorry. You put down, you take a dog in, you, and if you can't take care of it, just do the same thing you would do to a child. If you can't take care of it, you give it to someone else who can. You don't flip and put it down. That's what I hate when uh, I deal with my sword. I'm sorry to all those who take Plan B pills. I'm not trying to be mean, but I'm sorry. I have my beliefs and I'm going to stand by them. I don't like that. You can't handle the kid. 
you give it away. It's still well and kicking. Urg, huh? Sound like Bulbasaur, you solar beam. Here it comes. Oh, see, that's awesome. They're letting uh, Bulbasaur have his moment to shine. So the Machoke is like saying like, oh, I'm, I'm too strong for this. And then... So the thing came back. I, I don't... Okay, no, I'm confused. So does, should I use Bulbasaur now? Technically, Bulbasaur was the one that just attacked him. So, sure, why not? Bulbasaur have a special ball too? Awesome. Oh, that was a burp. All right, let's do a solar beam. So that's what he was using, technically. Mm. E tackle. All right. Solar beam. Ba, 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 like I love Bulbasaur when he does the solar beam because it sounds like he's doing a Kamehameha wave or something. Ba, 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 ba. <laughs> uh, okay, let's do a tackle. Okay, that did terrible. I immediately regret it. And I immediately regret the fact that I didn't use Solar Beam again. Okay, good. It used Growl. Woo! Alright, Bulbasaur's attack fell. I'll explain why it did not work. Alright, don't use the attack. Oh, thank God. Oh, that sounds awesome. Anyway, so back to the other issue I have. So, I'm not trying to be offensive to women who use the Plan B pill. I'm sorry, but I couldn't do it. Especially since some of you guys know why I say I really couldn't do it. But even before that, I couldn't. I will admit, me and my wife want before when we were first started dating it to happen. But I told her, you know what, I can't do it. We both agreed, actually. We couldn't do it. Like, she was really afraid because she didn't want to think that she I was going to leave. Because she had bad experience with, like, her brother and stuff with doing this with women. But, so she was afraid. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm doing a really depressing story for something so soon. Should I need Bulbasaur? No, I'm good with Bulbasaur. In the first place, huh? You don't need power speed. All you need is a connection between you and your Pokemon. The connection between me and my Pokemon. What's your name, boy? You're a pretty mouse. <laughs> so still a little creepy Professor Oak. You take this book. The book digs an excitement of Pokemon. Whenever you see Pokemon, his data is recorded in it. By the time you complete this, Pokemon, you might become the champion of Kanto region. Anyway, good luck. He's going to still say this, this the line, isn't he? Oh, good, he's not. Alright, so I guess we're going to call it quits there because this has been going on for a while, so we're going to just quickly save. And yes, I would like to save. So this has been King Game, guys. Uh, like I said, I've missed you guys. I love doing videos like for you guys. So I hope you enjoyed this, and we'll be back next time on Pokemon Red's Adventure. See you guys next time. Bye!